Bob Green, I'm being Bob St. John's TV with our great gun, Hannah Cameron Phil. The officials have been appointed by the Central Area Council of the British Boxing Border Control, whose area representative sitting in the ring side is Ms. Sally. On the first contest is for Freedom of Boxing in the Superman Light Division. Introducing to the first of Boxing Hour, so I'll be group on our one of the Black Wish Off, Trip with Yarrow and White. At the ring, who's down at 11 South, 10 miles from the Superman Light Division. Tonight is his 140th professional contest, and alone in 2023, this is his 27th year. Welcome, please, for Islington Jordan. Well, you know, yeah. And the and boxing out of the record, Randy. One for the show is pink, the Randy Scout, and that was Two pounds, 14 ounces. As an amateur, he had an impressive knockout for Sensitive tonight. He makes his power professional debut. Hailing from Bolton, Ryan Silverman. He signs the ball at the ball and goes running on the final three. In charge of the action, Jimmy Kempatrick from Preston for three minute rounds. <laughs> First concert of the evening tonight here between Jordan Grant coming to the red corner, Division to London, and Raham Musa coming to the blue corner from Bolton. It's an interesting contest this tonight, Lee, this first contest. Um, as we know, Jordan Grant quite experienced, um, good fighter, uh, great, great qualities he's got against Musa. Uh, basically, he's on his debut, so we don't know too much about him. Yeah, he's got uh, apparently a 75% knockout ratio in the amateurs. Comes from Bolton, which is out of Mayor Carnesium. Granham in his 143rd professional outing tonight. Jordan the Brown Eagle Granham. 31 years of age. His 90 year old debutant, Raham Musa. The Pink Bugs. Yeah, very, very interesting fight. As we know, Jordan can mix it up a little bit if he needs to. Um, and we are aware that Musa, like you say, you say 75% knockout ratio. Um, if you try to put it on Gordon, uh, Jordan Granham, then um, we'll see what Jordan has to say about that. As we know, when people tend to put it on him, he does come back. Um, he lets them know, you know, obviously what he's capable of. Nice attack there from uh, Musa. Great guard though by Granham as usual. Referee tonight, Jamie Kirkpatrick of Preston. The tall kid Musa, he's got a nice, nice long reach and he's got a good jab. That's on slightly by Musa. Also defended there uh, by Granham, who comes back with a jab of his own. Who's just flicking his jab up. out. Yeah, it's a sort of tentative start, but you know. Musa looks like he's kind of loading up with them shots. He's not overexerting himself. Nice and easy, but um, he does look heavy handed. They do well to get Granham out of there. Jordan's going to stop three times, he's 128 defeats. 
Yeah, took took up quite well. Granham taking a few on the gloves there. First professional round in the bag there for Musso. Yeah. Any particular time hurt Granham though? Yeah. Boom boom. Shit room round two. We have head promotions here in association with Elite Gym present professional boxing in the University of Bolton Stadium. Hey, good. I think it was a good first round that for Musa. I think he was uh, quite quite in control really. Again, nothing too much happening, but he was landing some good shots. Jordan taking on the gloves and the arms. I think a couple got through, but Jordan doesn't seem troubled too much. Those shots aren't going to stop grinding around the body. Just place him in there rather than snapping him in. Nice jab. Lovely little one two to the body. John Granham is 20th and out in the season uh, of the year, sorry. He was having a chat with Jordan earlier. Um, amateur career, he had 31 amateur fights with 28 wins. He actually was 25 and 0 when he boxed for Islington ABC. He was a two time national champion, A and B class, at welterweight. He's obviously now, uh, you know, he's come out now as a middleweight. He's obviously matured a little bit. He did start boxing from the age of 14. Shot there by Moose over the top. Jordan Grand and a brown eagle catch him on the gloves. He's quite a clever fighter, Moose, isn't he? Really, he's, you know, he's quite technical. He's not, he's not really getting involved. He's boxing at range. He's using his attributes. His nice long jab doesn't get too close. So he's, you know, he's got. He's, looks like he's got quite a good experience. Bring it into the pro ranks. Jordan quite happy to take the centre of the ring there. Again, good shots from Musa, but Granham taking him on the gloves. Another round in the bank for Musa. We're the halfway stage of the fight. Crowd shouting for it. Stepping down, round three. Yeah. Boom, boom, shit, round three. Middleweight clash between Ray and Musa coming out of the blue corner and Jordan Granham coming out of the red corner. So far, Moose has had it all his own way. Nice uppercut there. Snacking, snapping Granham's head back. Yeah, it looks like he's trying to step it up a little bit this third round. As we've seen before, when, you know, when kids try to have a fight with Jordan, he, um, he, he puts it back on him. This Musa is uh, he's being quite clever. He's not he's not getting too close. Not allowing Jordan to carry out any of his work to get his shots off. And again, as we said, it's down it's down to Musa, the home fighter, to put it on the way fighter, Granham. As he said, he got caught there at Musso. Yeah, he could, that comes back now. Gives it a go. Nice jab there by Granham.
Big shout for the crowd. Yeah, I think it, uh, crowd is shouting out. I think you missed with that over and right. Have they got good support? Again, you know, he's, he's throwing some good shots, but Jordan's soaking them up on the gloves. Yeah, totally agree, Mike. Shots on TSB, it's Bird Granon and Morgan Musso. Is he looking a little bit tired this round? I was just going to say that, Lee. Jordan's backing him up there with a the jab. I think when, I think when he gets on the back foot, Jordan backs him up. I think he get you know, he's not the same fight as he is coming forward. Towards the end of the third round, there's no round in the back for Musso. Although Granon did have a success in that round. Good round, we finish the round. Second round for the fourth and final round. Yeah, Bim Boom shake room, the fourth and final round. Moose the blue, the random red. Well, myself and Mike have got it three rounds to Moose. Yeah, I think he, I think he just stepped off a little bit that last round. Maybe it's just tiredness, or you know, it's, for, it's his pro debut, so I suppose it's expected. Um, Jordan had a little bit of success, but we still give that third round to Musa. And again, I think I think I'd like to see Jordan push him on the back foot a little bit more. See what he can do on the back foot. We have seen that, and I think he's, you know, he did. Jordan did have a little bit of success when he pushed him back. Same again there. Yeah, let's see what he's got himself, defence-wise. Yeah, I'd just like to see Jordan coming forward again, which he seems to be doing now. And not letting Musa have it all his own way. Nice jump by Granham. It's a bad to body by Musa. Nice double jab by Granham. Lovely right hand. A little bit of confidence there from Jordan. A little experience. Yeah, I think the, I think Moose has dropped the pace off a little bit late in this last round. Jordan's catching him with some good shots. I think he looks like he's blown a little bit late, Musa. Certainly. The Granham is probably sense it. Don't forget he's under the 40 for the type we say. And when you're in there, Mike, as, as we know, you can sense if the guy's getting tired. Although he's rallying back now, moves off. Lovely left up. Interesting final minute. I think if he's going to try and mix it with Jordan now, he's, you know, he, he may come unstuck. He's better off keeping it arranged, keeping that long jab, just move off. Especially the latter stages around. Decent debut from Musa though. Yeah, Jordan talking to him. Referees have nothing at all to do in this fight, it's been that good. Crowd still backing Musa, trying to get him to come forward, trying to encourage him. Jordan just slips out of the way, rolls. Forty thirty six moves off. Info, news and latest interviews, amateur and pro, across the north, click and subscribe. VIP, 
boxing promotions. Also, Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook.